Good day, everybody. It is currently Wednesday, January 3rd, a little after 11 a.m. Mountain Time. We're going to do one more video of uh, Howard Rock and Roller's Ice Tong Magic Grip and Toss and see what we can do. In the first two sessions so far, we are up $1,000 from our $600 bankroll. We're going to take half of it, add it to our working bankroll. The other half goes in our rack. We're still on our $5 minimum table, 500 maximum with 10 times odds. We're going to be throwing a dice set. My green die will be the 3, 2. My red die will be 4, 5. So it's an all seven set because we're throwing an off axis toss. We don't want spin on the dice. We want them to land and split apart. Let's see here. Let's grab two dice. One green and one red. There's my red. And my green. Even though we're on a $5 table, we're going to come out with a $15 pass line bet. 15 on the all tall small, broken down into a 6 3 6 split. $5 crap check. And we're going to lay the 10 for $100. Just in case we do hit that number up at the beginning, we want it to be, be more valuable. Be profitable. Let's get started and see what we can do. Hope everybody had a good new year. Or you're starting one off a good year anyway. Come out, roll. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Five one six five one six. We're gonna lose our craps check. We're gonna pull down our lay bet. Point is six. Get some change. I'm going to put 240 each on the 6 and 8, 200 on the 5 and 9, 75 each on the 4 and 10. We have about 25 oh, $25, $30 left in the rack. Dice are out. 3, 2, 4, 5. That is a 6 6 12 midnight box cards. All the dots we got, however you want to say it. Mark the 12, nothing happens with the money. Dice are out. 3 2 Four, five. Five, four, nine, five, four, nine. Mark that nine. We have two hundred on the nine. It's going to pay. 280. 
and I'm going to pay it like this. Take a red chip out of the rack. We're going to press up 160 across. We're going to add 25 more each to the 4, 5, 9, and 10. About a quarter left. It's going to come back in the rack. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Hard ten, fifty five. Your girlfriend's best friend is the hard 10. Mark the 10. We have 125 on that 10. It's going to pay 250. But it's going to cost me $6. I'm going to give the dealers 10 for change. This is where we're going to pull down our bets because we just we are now over four hundred dollars in profit minus our initial out out or outlay or yeah okay so let's see like this. This still short on our reds. I'm gonna grab uh, fifty dollars worth of reds. You see how far that takes us? Okay. So our bankroll is intact. We are currently. Four hundred eighty-nine dollars ahead. An eleven hundred dollar bankroll. We want two hundred twenty dollars in profit, or twenty percent. So we're going to take three hundred. I'm going to color these green chips up. We'll take three hundred of it. Set it aside in our profit tray. We're going to play with the other hundred eighty-nine dollars. Okay. We're going to give the dealers $4 and put them on the inside numbers for a dollar each. We're going to come out and we're going to play $110 on the inside. Keep the rest in the rack. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Two, three, five, two, three, five. Mark the five. We have 25 on that 5 is going to pay 35. The dealers have got a dollar in there. They're going to win double that. So they're going to, we're going to press up the 5 and the 9 up one each for the dealers. And what we're going to do is we're going to rack the green. 
we're going to press up, well, we're going to put $10 place bet on the 10 because we've hit it once before. Let's see if we can have something on it so that we can become profitable. Dice are out, three, two, four, five. Hard 10, too bad I didn't hop the hard 10. Already marked, we have $10 on the 10, it's going to pay 18. Dealers didn't win anything, but we're going to take uh, $2 from our winnings and we're going to press, put a dollar each on the other, on the 4 and 10 for the dealers. We are going to rack $5, we're going to put $10 on the 4. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Hard four, twenty two, the ballerina, because it's a two, two. Mark the four. The dealers have got a dollar in that four, it's going to pay double. We are going to press up our, for the dealers, a dollar on the heart, on the four and the ten. We have ten dollars on the, on the uh, four, it's going to pay eighteen. We're going to come out and put Two dollars on the hard ten, one dollar on the hard four, fifteen dollars in the cum. And everybody keep your mind out of the gutter. Dice are out. Three, two, four. Five. Here's our seven. One, six, seven. Eight tosses. Everything comes down except the comeback which is going to win $15. I know it's a poor consolation prize, but at least it's something. You don't lose everything on the seven. Profit on this shooter ended up being we're going to color this up. We're going to give dealers the 36. We're going to keep 400 of it. Set it aside. Reset. Come out again. Now normally, if it wasn't for the video, I would go home right now with a $400 profit. So. $15 on the ATS, the same split. Get a new set of dice. Same dice set. I still I'm still not comfortable throwing this toss. 
just doesn't feel as natural as I would like it to. It'll become natural, it's just I gotta find out what it is that I'm doing wrong. Be nice if Howard would, uh, Rock and Roller would give me a, some online pointers, but that's okay. Three, two, four, five, come out, roll, dice are out. One, one, two, craps, two, and I didn't have a craps check out there. Mark the two, we're going to lose our pass line. Come right back out. Put another one out there. Five dollar crap check. Hundred dollar lay the ten. Still a come out roll. Dice are out. Three, two. Four, five. Four, five, nine, four, five, nine. Gonna lose our craps check. Pull down the lay. Nine is our point. Get some change. Hundred fifty on the six and eight, one hundred on the five and nine. And you know what? We're just gonna, we're gonna put five dollars each on the hard four, hard ten. I mean, we've hit both of those. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Six, three, nine. Point is made. Six, three, nine. Puck comes off. Win 140 on our place bet, 15 on our pass line bet. And pull all our bets down. We're 120, well, not quite. Get some change for this. So we are $120 in profit. We're going to put $5 crap check. And we're not going to put anything out on the lay. We're going to put the $100 left over in our chip rack until we establish a point. Dice are out. Come out, roll. Three, two, four, five. One, one, two, craps, two. The two is already marked. We're going to lose our pass line of 15, but we're going to win 35. So it's a difference of twenty dollars, and our bed is, and we replace our pass line. We're going to add that to our rack. Come back over. Still, we come out roll. 
Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Three, one, four, three, one, four. Lose our craps check. Point is four. We're going to mark it. We're going to give the dealer $70 and tell him to set us up on 66 on the inside. Gives us four dollars change for our seventy. We're gonna put two dollars on the hard four, hard ten. Try to get one hit, and then we'll do a, a come progression or something. Dice are out. Three, two, four. Four, two, six, four, two, six. Mark the six. We have eighteen on the six is going to pay twenty one. $15 come, press up to six one unit. Dice are out, three, two, four, five. Is a two one three craps three. Nothing happens as money. Mark the three. All we have left on the small side of the bet is the five. We are going to lose our come bet though. Uh, we're going to come out. We're going to lay that five for 60 bucks. Just as a protection. Against the bad number. So no matter what happens, we still come out ahead. Just not by much, but we're not playing for much. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Four, six, ten. Four, six, ten. Mark the ten. Going to lose our hard ten. Not putting anything back up. We're not risking any more money. Dice are out. Three, two, four, five. Three, two, five. We just hit the five, folks. Oh, okay. So what's going to happen? Mark the five. We're going to lose our $60 lay. And on this table, we only pay on a win. We only do a big on a win, not on a loss. 
our place bet of a, on the five is fifteen dollars. He's going to win twenty one. We just hit the small. We have six dollars on the small. That comes down, gets paid thirty to one. So that's a hundred eighty dollars. And our bet comes down. So that sixty dollar investment turned into a hundred eighty dollar. What we're gonna do is put another dollar on the hard ten. We're gonna press up our five and nine up to twenty twenty five dollars each. And we're going to add another white chip that goes onto the hard 10. So we replenish our chip rack again. We are now $150 in the rack. We're going to come out again with another $15 come bet. And we're good to go. Are out three, two, four, five. Four, three, seven, seven out, ten tosses. Everything comes down except our comeback. If the comeback is going to win 15, consolation prize. Total profit on this shooter is $190. We'll give them uh, one, two, three, four, forty bucks. Make up the last time. It's going to color up. So our profit on this shooter is a take-home profit. It was 150. Add that to our first shooter profit. We now have $550. Add that to our total profit. $1550. We'll make it easy. We're just going to give the dealers another $50 out when we walk out the door, tell them thank you, see them when we come back again. And, uh, Hopefully they'll remember us. So our total profit right now is $1,500 off of using the Ice Tong Magic Grip and Toss. Hope everybody enjoyed. You know what to do if you did. Again, thanks to Howard Rock and Roller Newman. And everybody have a great hump day and hopefully we will see you when we come back again so till then take care stay safe god bless i'll see you then